Well, good day, everybody. Uh, let's jump. <laughs> These markets are great, huh? Let's jump in and talk about corn real quick. Uh, I think that my headline for the first little paragraph here is be 50 cents in 50 hours, right? I mean, spot corn hit uh, 574 uh, before the USDA uh, on Tuesday. And, and last night it fell down to 524 and three quarters. Now we've had a little bit of a climb back here. Corn finished up uh, around a percent on the day, about, you know, just over five cents. But uh, again, that one's kind of a, a buckle up uh, scenario because that's probably going to happen more often. 50 cents in 50 hours ish, right? What, what are the main culprits? The main culprits of why that's the case? I think number one is the USDA carryout uh, numbers and the arguments that China might not import quite as much as some had initially expected. Uh, but number two, the one thing that's kind of doing the rounds is the quote unquote cancellation uh, yesterday of unknown corn to 132 uh, of 132,000 metric tons. So that was kind of uh, uneasy. I think was probably the best thing to say. That was that, that put the market kind of on uh, on its edge. It was a little nervy. Uh, so those two main culprits being the USDA carryout and arguments that China might not be importing as much, as well as the cancellation. So <clears throat> that was also interesting to see. And then finally, you know, China still in the news reports that China might have been a buyer on this big break, uh, right? I mean, there's always those types of things that do arounds in the market when folks are trying to express an interest in why something happened. Um, but with the dollar trading sideways, we're gonna hear more and more about what folks think might have happened and uh, they're gonna blame the sell off on the funds selling and the blame the bounce back here on China buying. You'll hear a lot of that stuff, it's kind of noise. But uh, there has been talk of the reason why we've seen this buyback is, or this bounce back is because China's been in there buying a little bit. So keep all those things in mind, uh, but this is not gonna go away. We're in for, uh, for a fun summer, uh, for sure.